Sunday morning. Got everything packed in the car. <clears throat> We're gonna have breakfast with Eric and Tina, and then we are headed back to Emporia. So the last uh, day or so has been pretty sporadic with pictures and both videos and things like that. So I'm just gonna kind of walk you through some of the stuff we did. Of course, first we're not gonna have breakfast with Eric and Tina. I give you a bottle of Tide. Because our dirty laundry is too much. Yeah, is this a, is How this did a you problem? Know? Yeah, no, we, we actually we, have been meaning to talk to you about something. <laughs> that's why we're having this meeting. Yeah, that's right. You brought the soap too, right? Just like the bar soap? Yeah. Yeah. No, yeah. no uh, we did We did a load of laundry. We, we needed to do a load of laundry. We will make use of this. But, yeah, we will. So we did it and day, thought actually. we would do it. By the way, this is not a paid endorsement for Tide. So one of the things you ha that I always say you have to do when you're in this area is you have to go to In-N-Out Burger. So we stopped by and had some In-N-Out Burger. You have to go to this place wherever you go if they have this place. You must go there. People are giving me weird looks with my camera. Ask me if I care, Robert. Hey, Bobby. Do you care about the weird looks you just got with your camera? Kind of. I mean, it makes me a little uncomfortable. So. <laughs> thank you for asking. Yeah, thanks for asking, by the way. Welcome to In N Out Burger. Oh, thank you very much. Welcome to In N Out wow. Burger. Is this the official In N Out Burger career? Yes. Please enjoy your stay. Your lunch. What are you going to get? A burger. Cheeseburger. Cheeseburger, cheeseburger. Surprise. No cheeseburger, Amber. What are you going to get, Bobby? I'm gonna get a cheeseburger, but you know, I'm gonna get protein style. You know do, you get, do you get animal style? You know, what the, you, surely you know what that is, right? Come on, I gotta ask. I didn't know until I got some in Austin. I know what you need, Bobby. What do I need? You need. A glass, I mean, there's like seven things on the menu. You need a glass of milk. Ooh, what? yeah. Hey, I'll offer it right there. I don't do. Do you guys drink milk with with? I can't drink milk. No, 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 no. You, with you I dip can't. Your cheeseburger. In the milk? Yeah, it's very similar to cookies, except for in Greece instead. Oh, gross. In and out style. That is not in and out style. In and out style, Bobby. In and out style. I know you call yourself a foodie and not know what in and out style is. Whatever. <laughs> That was good, in and out Burger. My fries were a little not fresh tasting. They were a little so stale. I'd have to give the fries probably a two out of five fries. The burger was good though, so I'm gonna give that a four out of five patties. Did you get animal style on your fries, Bobby? Yes, I did. All right. What's your rank? What's your rating? I've had in and out before. I mean, it was pretty good. It wasn't my favorite. So I'd probably give it a, uh, probably give it a three and a half out of five animals. For, you know, for animal style. Right. Three out of five patties, is that what you said? Yeah, three out of five. And not, I'm talking burger patties, not Patty LaBelle. Yeah. Uh, you know, I actually never thought you were talking about Patty LaBelle. It's weird that you would think that someone would think that. <clears throat> Maybe Patty would think that. the airport now and doing a little work before we get on the plane so what did we do that oh after in and out burgers we went and saw a plate against sports plate against sports is a place that we have our discs and not all of them but some of them so we wanted to check the inventory level at this uh, plate against sports in Arizona We like to check out stores that carry our stuff. One of the stores that, one of the chains, chains is it, franchises, is played against sports. So we happened to see this while we were driving by and we thought, well, let's see what they got of our stuff. Oh. This is an oldie. 
Excalibur. Look at that. What? What is that? Yeah, we're good. We just we're looking. We're with Dynamic Discs, and oh, okay. we we're checking out your your selection. And then I just just saw that. Just got it. Yeah. All right, so not a whole lot of our stuff in there, but as you can see, the shipment just came in. So hopefully, this Mesa, Arizona, plate against sports will have more of our stuff. If you're in the area, come by and uh, shop the Mesa, Arizona, plate again. Get some more D's in there. D's. More frizz. Throw some D's on it. Throw some D's. Hold on, there's a there's a car coming behind us. Alright folks, we're gonna tune in because Jeremy has already proven that he is the master at the parallel parking. Just turn your bike around and help Alright. So now we're gonna figure out if Here goes Robert nothing, everybody. One point. Oh, oh gosh. Oh, it's going to hurt the curb. Oh, this is going to hurt. Is it? Oh, it's going to hurt the curb. Is it going to hurt the curb? Oh, or gonna Is it going to hurt the curb or am I exactly perfect? Tell me that's not pretty darn good there, people. Hey, two point. Wait, that's a, that's not a two point. You, every time you turn, it's a, two, a point, right? I didn't have to like correct. I was really close to the curb. Oh, so you're not even moving up. I'm good, man. I think so this you're is calling a good this spot. a one point? I call this a one point. How, how close are we to the curb? Let's check it out. On the curb. Uh, you're on the curb. Like all the way up on it? Like the like rubber. Like my wheel is touching it. Where, right? where the rubber meets the road. Well, the, if the wheel is touching it, that's okay. But that's. Ah, I don't know, dude. I feel like that's pretty you, good. You, you'd have to. Is he out? You're, I don't know. He, you need to move up to make it, he, to is, correct it. Yeah, is he in or, I think he's out. <laughs> or I'm just, curious. We're just joking, man. That I'm gonna, good, right? I'm gonna have to judge this as a two-point parking. Hey, listen, that was a, hey, that was good. <laughs> no, don't let anyone tell you different. All right, the rounds are over for today. Third round. Whoo! It was a long day. Uh, we're headed to team dinner to have a little fun with the team Dynamic Discs members. Turn right onto Going to Carlsbad Tavern. See, it's clever because it's kind of like Carlsbad Caverns but different because it, it's a tavern. There you go. Hey, you guys are going the wrong way. You're going the wrong way. No, you're going the right way. We're picking up Rusko. Who? We're picking up Rusko over here. Who? Yeah. Is he important? Do you know him? Who is he? You should meet him. You should be. His name's Jeremy. I like dynamic disc, so I think I should, is he, does he cool know guy. dynamic disc? Yeah, I know, he's a cool guy. Okay. You can tell because he's like, cool. He's really cool? Yeah, you, you'll like know which cool? one he is. Is yeah. he cold? Yeah. You should get him a jacket. Yeah, you should. Sounds good, man. Where's the kitty kitty? Kitty just ran back there. Aww. She's eating a spazoid. Yeah, she's also Pretty terrified. Usual. A spoutzoid. Dude, spoutzoid? That's crazy. Am I going to sound really tough on camera? Where's the kitty kitty? Where is he? Kitty? I was looking for a cat, but I can't I don't care about you. Where's the cat? Where's the cat? Yes, 
Good luck good. to y'all. I think they call it the Yeah. Yeah. Amazing. And it's like so perfect. And now we're getting videoed by, what's your name? Bobby. Bobby. And we met the owner of the camera today. How have you been liking your time out on the road in I Vegas like it. I and like Memorial? It a lot. Why are you talking like a robot? Am I? <laughs> I love it. How's the move to Emporia been? The move to Emporia has been great. I have lived there for like a day and a half, and then I came to Arizona. And my wife, who is a saint and an angel and the best person that there ever was, this is true, <laughs> is unpacking all of our stuff with, with, with her mom right now. While you're at a bar. Yeah, seriously. While I'm out like living the dream and walking around with players. It's pretty fantastic. But I'll report back about Emporia in like a couple months. How are you enjoying the tournament, Paige? I'm enjoying it very well, Bobby. <laughs> so we're on the plane headed back to Wichita, and then we'll drive to Emporia. So um, the hang ride's pretty good. It's only about an hour and 40 some odd minutes. But so anyway, so one of the some other stuff that we got to capture on the last day of the tournament is uh, some disc golf action of our players. It was a beautiful day. Not very much win until uh, later in the day, but so I was able to capture some really nice disc golf action. So hopefully you enjoy.
headed to on the shuttle bus to get to our car and then driving back home. I want to very proud of Donald Ellsworth Giggler for his performance in the Master Division. Yeah, man. So we're going to take a quick look at his some of his, I caught a few of his beginning holes and then the last two holes. Some amazing disc golf from Giggler. Let's check that out. Next up, out of Allen, Texas, representing Dynamic Discs, Donald the Giggler Ellsworth. Donald did an excellent job. Congratulations on winning the Masters Division. We're also very proud of Paige Pierce for her win at the Memorial. She crushed it. I believe she was eight under par for the entire tournament and just dominated like she does. Let's take a look at some of her shots from the final round at the Memorial.
Memorial Women's Open Champion, Paige Pierce. Thank you guys for watching. This is by far the biggest gallery we've had at the Memorial, so thank you guys. Again, congratulations to Donald and to Paige, and great work to all of the Team Dynamic Discs member that made it out to uh, Gentlemen's Club Challenge and the Memorial. Um, I'm back in Emporia. We're all back in Emporia, ready to get back to regular work. Let me know that you enjoy these disc golf adventures so I can let Jeremy know, and we will keep doing them. So until next time, remember to be extraordinary, be passionate, and be dynamic.